I think the the preseason scheduling, uh, pre-conference schedules extremely challenging for us. Um, you know, a chance to play some some really good teams, a handful of teams that were that were in the Sweet 16 last year, and and teams that are perennial top 25 teams with Oregon and um, BYU and Ohio State. Uh, but some some interesting games for us as well. Um, I think the St. Louis game is is a it's a, another solid program. The a team that we feel like you know we have a shot at, and same with Loyola. You know, very very good program over the last three or four years but um, maybe we're, we're catching them at a good time next year so uh, we're really excited about the preseason schedule excited to to get a tournament back here at home to finish up on the fourth weekend um, and get us a little bit of rest going into conference and and then as we jump into conference schedule um, I think all of a sudden we put ourselves a target on ourselves uh, with the way we finished up last year so we're gonna have to start conference um, really well like we did last year. I felt like we had a great start to conference season last year, but we're able, unable to maintain that uh, throughout the year. So we got to be able to find a way to be a little bit more consistent during conference play and, and put ourselves in a good position come conference tournament. And then of course to wrap up the season conference tournament at home. Um, I think that's a, a great thing for us. Um, we've been definitely a better home team over the last couple of years than we have been on the road. So I, I think that's an advantage, and and we're gonna have to try to, to defend the WAC championship on on our home court, and I'm sure everybody's gonna be be coming for us. I know New Mexico State will be out looking for some revenge, and and UMKC added some nice players to their roster, so it's gonna be a great WAC season.